Alright, so I'm back with Dragon Age Inquisition. I trust all is well. Alright. That's enough for now. Another time then. I was just making sure she ain't had nothing else. Alright. Well, I'm back with Dragon Age Inquisition and I guess what I wanna do this time is go talk to where the fuck is she? Uh right here? Yeah. I could fast travel to her? How the fuck is she even a fast travel point? Nigga, I ain't even click on the um, fast travel shit, yo. I clicked on her, whatever. Alright, well, I wanted to go talk to uh, Moore again, right here. Alright, so I'm back with Mother said you were scary. <laughs> Why would your mother say such a thing? Because people fear the next stage if it comes too soon. Kieran, are you bothering the Inquisitor? Of course not. Did you see what's on his hand, Mother? I did see. It is time to return to your studies, little man. Hmm. <sighs> <laughs> My son. Never where you expect him to be, naturally. I didn't know you had a son. Why would you? I take great pains to not let my own reputation affect him in any way. To most in the Imperial Court, he's simply a quiet and well-spoken lad. Perhaps the heir of some distant family. But he goes where I go. Worry not, Inquisitor. Kieran is a curious boy, but seldom troublesome. Nigga, I already know who his dad is, but fuck it. Will his father be joining us as well? It would be... most unlikely. His father helped raise Kieran for a time, but events have conspired to take him elsewhere. So, tis but the two of us, Inquisitor. Your fortress is a large place, and you will scarce notice our presence. He seems like a fine young man. But not the sort one might expect a woman like me to raise? No son of mine would be raised in a marsh bereft of contact with the outside world. His future will be difficult enough without my adding to his burden. To think, until recently, this place stood decrepit, occupied only by the desperate and the lost. Now it is party to events that threaten to shake the world. I wonder if it is pleased. It sounds like you've heard of Skyhold before. This fortress was built upon the remains of a site holy to the ancient elves. They called it Tarar Salan, the place where the sky is kept. It is said that from here, they reached up to the heavens to bring them down to rest. They abandoned it, as did the humans who came after them. Bones laid upon bones, silent until your arrival. I like this place. I've made it mine. The magic in this place has seeped into the stones, protecting it from darkness. Those who let it fall to ruin did not know what they possessed. You, I think, shall do it justice. You were kind to welcome my aid, Inquisitor, even knowing as little of me as you do. I will do my best to aid your cause with all the knowledge at my disposal. This I swear to you. I appreciate whatever help you can give us. Some might think Corypheus a madman for seeking godhood. Yet one must ask, what were the old gods? What secrets of theirs did the ancient magisters know? What I fear, what all should fear, is not that Corypheus believes he can succeed, it is that he actually may. Were uh, anything else? Greetings, Inquisitor. Now that you've seen the Inquisition up close, what are your impressions? Tis remarkable what you have built. I will give you that. A web of favors has wrapped every noble family in southern Thedas around your fingers. All this in precious little time conjured from thin air through the power of fervor alone. I wonder if Corypheus suspected what he was enabling, just as I wonder what will become of all this once he is defeated. Whatever happens, the Inquisition will survive. That alone is worthy of wonder. A new player on the stage, a figure of might and marvel. Beware the heights you reach, Inquisitor. When this is done, many will be eager to knock you back down. 
What work have you been doing to help us? Currently, my efforts are focused on determining what Corypheus is, and from where his power comes. The elven orb he carries is what draws my attention. I wonder if the power he used to tear open the Fade, in fact, came from the orb. Perhaps it is even the source of your anchor. If I learn of its origin, I may also learn what Corypheus now intends, as well as his weaknesses. However you can help, it's appreciated. Continue prodding at Corypheus, Inquisitor. Elicit a reaction, and we may yet learn from it. I'd like to know more about you. Ah, yes. Whence comes the mystery woman slinking her way into the Inquisition's ranks? Once I was an apostate, living well away from the banal influence of the Chantry in the Kakari Wilds. Then came the Fifth Blight with its dark spawn, and I left Ferelden for the Empress's court. It is certain the nobles of Orlais breathe a collective sigh of relief that I am now here. You were in Ferelden during the Blight? The Blight began in the Kukari Wild, so yes, I experienced it firsthand. Indeed, I fought at the hero of Ferelden's side for a time. He is the reason the Blight was defeated. We became close, closer than I even thought possible. <laughs> when I left, he pursued me. And after that, I came to Orlais, the last place one would look for me, or such was my hope. The Elysian Court seems like an odd place to find someone like you. That was the point, originally. I knew the Empress was intrigued by the Arcane, and that I could answer questions no Chantry Mage could. Thus, we fit together nicely. I became her advisor, and she my benefactor and source of refuge. Truth be told, our arrangement would not have lasted much longer. Too many wagging tongues, even for Selene. It's odd that an apostate could live so... openly. <laughs> It confuses those who expect apostates to cower and hide. I stand boldly before them and demand to know why I need some Chantry mage to teach me to control my power. They would put me on a leash so they can feel safer at night. I am uninterested in their comfort. Naturally, it helps to have friends in high places. Word. I'll leave you to the garden. Of course. Who else is over here? Nobody. What the fuck are little fucking... I was about to call him something, but then I was about to take it away, but fuck it, yo, it seems accurate, demon spawn kid. So, yo, doesn't, don't, um, great wardens become great wardens by drinking the blood of dark spawn, so, technically, they blood, the dark spawn blood is infused onto them, so, technically, they are, like, half dark spawn to begin with, so that nigga's like a, what the fuck? Oh, well, there was a red Jenny arrow over there, but they told me to examine it. I examined it, nothing happened. So, I don't get it. Damn. I was trying to hop on a... Nigga, I was trying to get my gnarls hole on, man. Oh, well. Man, I wanted to get rid of a bunch of this crap that I'm holding on to right now. I forgot to because... On a real, I found out mad late about that whole thing where you can like switch. Yeah, I, n I noticed that. You're gonna see a big ass skip and whatever the fuck I was just trying to talk to because I looked over on the left and my. Sh this shit freeze too damn much, yo. Fuck this. Alright, well, I'm about to sell. Actually, I don't even think I want to sell that. So I guess that's it. And where else did I want to Was there any other place that I wanted to go? Because. Uh, apparently I still didn't do the fucking shit, the right shit at the war table for Josephine yet, so. I really need to get that done. And I'm not treasure hunting. I'm not treasure hunting, I'm not doing requisitions right now. So is there anything else? Okay, since there isn't, I'm going on to do... Oh yeah, I gotta go to a war table though. But since I don't have nothing else to do on the map besides like requisitions and treasure hunting, I'm going on to do this last green spot and hopefully this isn't like the last last thing, man. I know my time in this game is almost coming to an end, but I want to see what the hell is. Unless they give me a warning like, nigga, this is the last shit in the game, yo. You better not be trying to go on and do this other bullshit. But fuck it.
adamant fortress has stood against the Darkspawn since the time of the Second Blight. Fortunately for us, that means it was built before the age of modern siege equipment. A good trebuchet will do major damage to those ancient walls. Thanks to our Lady Ambassador... Lady Cyril of Jader was pleased to lend the Inquisition her sabers. They've already delivered the trebuchets. That is the good news. None of that accounts for the Warden summoning a giant demon army. That is the bad news. The Inquisition forces can breach the gate, but if the Wardens already have their demons... I found records of Adamant's construction. There are choke points we can use to limit the field of battle. That's good. We may not be able to defeat them outright. But if we cut off reinforcements, we can carve you a path to Warden Commander Clorel. So our plan is to lay siege to a legendary fortress filled with demons. It'll be hard fought, no way around it. But we'll get that gate open. It's also possible that some wardens may be sympathetic to our cause. The warriors may be willing to listen to reason, though I doubt they will turn against Clorel directly. The mages, however, are slaves to Corypheus. They will fight to the death. We've built the siege engines and readied our forces, Inquisitor. Give the word, and we march on Adamant. Okay. Nigga, this isn't gonna be like a fucking I right, this is this is it type shit, right? Fuck it, we going. I need to buy time until them fucking operations is done. That's why. Fuck it. Uh I'm going with my new party and shit, but I really don't know if like they thing together is a good idea, but oh well. Cause I was still I still believe that sooner or later because of that shit that I pulled, uh, Vivian's going to turn on me. Actually, kind of the same thing with, um, Cole, too. I don't know why he would, but... There was no sound effect on there. Oh, god damn. Oh, shit! They really over there with a giant ass batter around. Oh my god. Alright, knocked open the gate. Oh, that stab though. Nigga, and then I walk in from the back like a ball, so yo, let's go. We doing this. Fuck the bullshit, nigga. Let me move, yo, shit. They all gotta die now, man. After after that cut team, man. Shit. You know me walking like a boss like that, man. They all gotta die, yo. Where the rest of them at, nigga? I want parts. Give me that. Oh, come on, man. I'm going through a cutscene while I'm trying to pick up loot. All right, Inquisitor. You have your way in. Best make use of it. We'll keep the main host of demons occupied for as long as we can. I'll be fine. Just keep the men safe. We'll do what we have to, Inquisitor. Warden Logan will guard your back. Hawk is with our soldiers on the battlements. He's assisting them until you arrive. Oh my god. There's too much resistance on the walls. Our men on the ladders can't get a foothold. If you can clear out the enemies on the battlements, we'll cover your advance. Alright. Oh, I was about to say, yo, that loot better still be there. So, uh, which one is which? Alright, so she all the way over there, so fuck that shit. I know where I'm trying to go now. Oh, I can't go that way, so fuck it. Oh, God. What the? Nigga, just die. Oh my god, yo. Don't be using that charging bullshit against me. Yeah, 
die. I gotta loot everything. That's kind of the rules of the game. And I just realized I forgot. Wait, no, I did sell that shit, didn't I? Yeah, I sold that shit. What the fuck I'm talking about? Alright, examine. Fuck it. I'm busy. Everybody gotta die sometime. Oh, I forgot I gave her an amulet of power, yo. Where's she at? Uh, she has all the shit for that. Not for the night enchanted shit, though. I don't even think I want to give her that one. Yeah, get rid of cooldown and all that shit. Yeah. Oh, man, I wish they would just let me. Use that crap when I jump in the air, yo. I want to just slash that nigga. They got. Is, was that her, yo? I don't know if it was, yo. That's why I'm not trying to walk into that. Yeah, I think it was. Oh, I was like, what the hell's with the green health shit, yo? That was. That's because those my niggas. Oh my god, they are getting destroyed. So I'm guessing that shit's gonna be up top somewhere. That shit isn't over here. Alright, open the gate. Yep, up top. Can I break this? No. This ain't breakable. Oh, hold up. Was that a bashable wall? Uh, I don't think so. No. I thought it was like a bashable wall behind all that shit, but I don't think so. Oh, shit. Seize point. Yeah, I think I want to do that. I'll do that. So I guess I gotta find siege points. Whatever the fuck those would be. Whoa! God damn it, Cole. Alright. Looting dead bodies for gold. That's how real niggas do it. I don't want to go over there yet, man. So where would I find these siege points at? Alright, and I found a schematic. Hey, that's really my main question. Where the hell would I find the siege points? God damn, somebody getting killed. Alright, do they show the siege points on my map? Alright, yeah, so that's one right there. Alright. Oh, shit. God damn it! All right, that's one. Soldiers are dying by the other side. That was a waste. Oh well, shit happened. I get hurt by the fire. They are dying so fucking quick. I'm a t I'm tempted to put it on hard right now, but yeah. Then again, I don't want to. So now I need to make sure that I uh, find the other siege points beforehand. Do I want to go back? I ain't gonna want to go back this way. No, I can't jump down there, can I? I don't think so. I'm looking at it and it looks like a far ass drop, yo. Because usually when it's black like that, that means I can't do that shit. Nope. So, how the fuck would I get over there then? Cause I need to find the uh, other two siege points before I go on to fight this chick. Fuck it, yo. Maybe I'll find it out when I get over here. God damn it. Alright. 
God damn it. Don't need a supply cash. I see a uh, rift down there a little late. Yo, it looks like I'm going to run into it if I go that way. But, oh, if I go through that door and just go this way. Fuck it, we'll see what. So what the fuck was that over there? Alright, that was the night commander. I want to go straight forward, though. I see a pride demon over here. We doing this shit. I want this optional shit done. Yo, don't run from me, nigga. I don't care if you're not a fucking dragon, man. Not only saying that because I got that massive dragon slam room, nigga. I'm not worried about them right now, so. Where's it at, yo? God damn, it's too far away now. Nigga! Get the fuck over here, yo. God damn it, yo. She's always running. Die. Where's the other one at? Alright, cool. Oh my god! I can't drag it, yo, and I don't feel like walking over there. Alright, is that the last one for the siege point? Yep. So, I need to get to the other one without passing the night commander. So, if I just keep going down this aisle way, should be like an aisle way to something. It should, yeah, it should be something so I can go downstairs. I have no idea what the fuck happened. Oh my god. I really could use that shit so that my shit gets stronger as I keep doing it, yeah. Except I don't have another point yet. That's exactly where that crap's going too, yo, as soon as I get it. And Cole's almost dead. Yo, I was keeping that spinny shit up the whole entire time. Yeah, but yeah, they did. Is that it for the siege point? Yep, that was the last one. I suggest we hurry. Demons will make short work of our forces. Nigga, I'm busy. Hold up. I'm trying to loot shit. Yo, they got a lot of. I think that's if you playing on hard, yo. That's why they got that shit here. I really don't want to know what hard's about, cause I know what hard was all about in the la in the first game. So I'm like, yeah, I'm good on that. I say, okay, so let me guess, yo, that amulet of power is not for anybody I have in my party right now. Yep, I knew it. It's never for anybody I got in my party when I pick them things up, yo. Cause it's been so many times when I found them for cold, but this ain't one of them times. Now Cole is ready to report in. Oh, fuck it. I thought I saw somebody coming up the stairs, yo, but fuck it. Alright. Hold up. I saw something shining in the background, but I was just going to ignore it, yo. I was like, because in the back of my head, I was thinking, oh, that was Aladdin. Nigga, I was like, and I was like, hold up, nigga, I haven't seen like Aladdin in a minute. Nothing down there, I was like, what the fuck is that? Fuck it. Apparently there's something right up ahead. Nigga, loot. Nigga. I knew there was... Man, let me pick it up, yo. Shit. They said my people can't... They can't survive against demons? Nigga. Demons can't survive against my niggas. Fuck this little lady. Alright, so there's no way up there. What about this path that I saw? Oh no, that wasn't even a path. Oh well. Uh, we going in. Uh, let's see, let's see. Alright, I see a box. Yep, taking that. 
And open this shit. Oh god. Wardens, we are betrayed by the very world we have sworn to protect. The Inquisition is inside, Clarel. We have no time to stand on ceremony. These men and women are giving their lives, Magister. That might mean little in Tavinta, but for the Wardens, it is a sacred duty. It has been many long years, my friend. Too many, Clarel. If my sword arm can no longer serve the Wardens, then my blood will have to do. Oh, shit. It will. <laughs> oh, my God. She using blood magic. Stop them. We must complete the ritual. Oh, I see Hawk. Where the fuck he come from? Carell, if you complete that ritual, you're doing exactly what Eremon wants. What? Fighting the blight? Keeping the world safe from dark spawn? Who wouldn't want that? And yes, the ritual requires blood sacrifice. Hate me for that if you must, but do not hate the wardens for doing their duty. We make the sacrifices no one else will. Our warriors die proudly for a world that will never thank them. And then he takes your mage's minds for his real master, Corypheus. Corypheus? But he's dead. These people will say anything to shake your confidence, Clarell. Bitch, believe me. Bring it through. You bitch. Yo, can I just bowl them all over so they can't do that, son? Between me and Cassandra, we could have stopped that. Cole could have fucking did his little. I have seen more than my share of blood magic. It is never worth the cost. I betrayed the wardens once and it cost me everything. Are you mad enough to think I'd do it again? Be ready with the ritual, Clarell. This demon is truly worthy of your strength. Listen to me. I have no quarrel with the wardens. I have spared those I could. I don't want to kill you. But you're being used! Some of you know it, don't you? The mages who've done the ritual? They're not right. They were my friends, but now they're like puppets on a string. You cannot let fear sway your mind, Warden Chernoff. He's not afraid. You are. You're afraid that you ordered all these brave men and women to die for nothing. One day you may be asked to give your lives to stop a blight, but not today. Lorel, we have come so far. You're the only one who can do this. Perhaps we could test the truth of these charges to avoid more bloodshed. Or perhaps I should bring in a more reliable ally. My master thought you might come here, Inquisitor. He sent me this to welcome you. The art. Oh, fuck you! Corel's about to get killed by that thing, ain't she? <laughs> Good thing I got my fucking master fucking dragon slaying rune on. Plus 32 damage against dragons, bitch. Oh my god! Who the hell did that? Oh, her. Yeah, she about to die. I think she dodged it. Yeah, she did.
Oh hell yeah, we help it. Nick oh Hold up. There's too much shit going on right now, man. Fuck that. the one time I'm going to give up loot. See that thing flying somewhere. Nigga, if this shit don't just stay out of my damn way while I'm trying to do this, man. It don't matter, though. I got this. Is that a door? No. It look like one. It look like some fancy ass fucking fancy but old at the same way door. Oh shit! You lucky I can't run no more. Just wait. Fuck you, nigga. Yo, I ain't afraid of you. Oh shit. Unless they want to be on some fuck shit, be like, oh, you know that shit level 25, right? That's the only time I might be like, uh, I ain't about that life. Nigga! What the fuck shit? Nigga, I thought she turned out. Fuck you. Oh my god. Oh, she got a shield on. I was like, damn. I saw this nigga really just barbecue her. Oh shit! <laughs> you did that to yourself, you stupid bitch. All I did was dangle a little power in your eyes, and you could have waited to get your hands bloody. Mmm. God damn. You could have served a new god. I will never serve the blight. Oh shit. Yeah, she dead. What the fuck? She was still moving. You niggas just standing there. Oh my god, yo. She is super dead. Oh my god. But yeah, she's super dead. If they let me, I'll save them, man. Oh, he just picked up low game. I was like, who the fuck did just pick up? I was like, nigga, Cassandra didn't even technically need to be here. How the hell you go back to pick her up? But I thought that's who he picked up. Oh, shit. Nigga just opened that shit. What? Did he really just send himself into the fucking fade? Oh, fuck. He, did he fall in with low game? That's what it looked like. I wasn't paying attention, though. Just picking up. I really only came over here to kill time too, yeah. That's the crazy shit about it. Blackout! 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 Blackout!